My name is Sarah Pete, and this is my story. So I grew up in a Lutheran home. We went to church almost every Sunday and knew about God, but it was very um, much just we went through the same things every single Sunday, and I didn't really know anything about the Bible. I didn't really understand any of it. Um, and when I was in high school, I started to get really um, mixed in with the wrong crowd, although from the outside you wouldn't know it. Um, I was really good at pretending, but I was also really desperate to have friends. Um, so on the outside, I would just, especially to my parents, I would look like I was the perfect straight A student who never got in any trouble. Um, I really don't like getting in trouble, um, but I was really good at lying and hiding it. And so I got mixed in with um, some Friday night crews that never really did me well. Um, but with that, I was at a party one night, and yes, I was underage, and there was stuff going on that just didn't need to be happening. And I remember being at that event and um, going out on the driveway and looking at the stars in the sky and saying, God, there's gotta be something better than this. Like, I need you. I don't understand this. And so from that moment, I knew that there was something bigger. And then I had a friend invite me to a youth event at her church. And from that moment on, I was like, yes, this is what I want. I want you, Jesus. I want you in my life. And from that moment in 10th grade, my life completely changed and turned around. And I made the choice to follow Jesus and it took me a while to get baptized. I was waiting for my parents and my brother to make the choice to follow Jesus first. But then all four of us got baptized at the same time, my senior year of high school, um, to show that um, we were followers of Jesus. So then after high school, God called me to serve in a ministry for two years, which radically changed my life. I then went to art school and really found the real calling that God had for my life. Um, and then he called me to full-time ministry by <laughs> marrying my husband. And um, that is how our life has been. So since Christ, I've, you know, I've still struggled. Like I've had to understand I'm not perfect, but I do understand that I have a God who is with me all the time that my life has been radically changed by Jesus and every single day is a new adventure with him.